Welcome back, everyone. Crimin Archer here. Time for some more Project Zomboid. Um, so we're dealing with a horde at the moment, and I led them into the trees. So hopefully that's that'll be a thing. But I don't know. Let's poke our heads back out here and see what it looks like. Hmm. Yep, yeah, that didn't work out so well, did it? I wanted more of them to head into the trees. That's okay. I'm worried. I'm trying to get to the bottom of town. There's a, a gas station down here. And a bar, which I feel like we could potentially make either one of those a potential safe house. But we gotta deal with the massive number of zombies first. Alright, so this, this building here is the last one, I believe, before the gas station. Oh, no, there's a diner and then the and then the gas station. Diner and the gas station, I think, share a parking lot? Oh, almost share a parking lot. Oh, he's super worn out. This is going to be problematic here in a second. Not now, dude. Okay, here's the gas station. It means we gotta start doing this. Alright, everybody. I need all of you. Everybody in gas station area. I need you all to come with me. Too spread out here. I need you guys to tighten up. Tighten up and fly straight. Alright. Now we're starting to work it. See a couple of you guys that are going the wrong way. Okay, that's a nice tight ball. Wish I had some fire. Just gotta find a whiskey bottle and a lighter and we'll be alright. Alright, so we take this little knot. And we take you guys this direction. Which you guys are spreading out more than I would like here. Oh, the hissing. All the hissing. Come with me. We're going this way. Go this way. If we can keep it together here. It's going to be a little tricky to keep them all together. Yeah, you guys can come too. I'm happy to have more groups. More groups. more groups that I lead away now, the less I have to deal with later. Oh. I got a little close to me there. <laughs> Alright, you guys. We're going in here. I go in here. Wave into the trees. And then I'm going to cut back this direction. Away from the zombies. Out the far side. And, like magic, we have significantly less zombies to deal with. Aw, did they leave you behind? That wasn't very nice of them. Let's get in it. Let's go in the gas station, shall we? Bring the trash cans? No. Not even a trash can lollipop. Orange soda. Orange soda. 
Where are you, Orange Soda? I saw you. There you are. I don't really care about being over encumbered right now. Actually, you know what? Let's uh, equip secondary. Equip one of these primary. And let's put a few things away. That'll help a little bit. I'm gonna try and sleep here. This could be end up being a terrible choice. But we're gonna give it a shot anyways. Empty gas can, gas can, coal, chips, thank you. Lighter, excellent. Now all we need is a whiskey bottle so that we can have some fire. Please die. Come on. Fall down, lady. There you go. Come on. No zombies in there. Should be a storeroom. It's right here, I guess. Can't really see. Walkie talkies. Another orange soda. I'll try to get this underneath the 16 line here. Uh, this doesn't look like we're going to pull it off here, but we might be able to make it. Four out of eight. Okay. Screwdriver comic book put two of these orange sodas away almost we put the last one away there we go all right so is there anything to sit on in here so we can't sleep without being able to sit on something this is a flaw in my master plan Magazine, boredom and stress, okay. Now, if you were asking me, I would say you should be able to sit on the trash on the toilet to fall asleep. But nobody asked me. So we're kind of screwed. Considering there's no nothing to sit on in here. <laughs> hmm. Which I don't really know what to do about. The only option is to continue moving on to the place that's a little ways down the road here but that requires us to deal with zombies in the middle of the night which is less than ideal this place right here and we are Ex excess exertion, which means that we're not ca like, capable of anything at this point. Alright. Okay, let's take all of our zombie friends. There aren't that many of them. But at our sleepiness level and... Oh, there was a, apparently a whole, a whole bunch of them standing in the trees right there, because they just all came out at once. Alright, so we're going to go this way. Please don't get hit. Alright, can we sneak past these guys? If we can sneak by this, past this little group here, which we cannot, as it turns out, we can probably get in there without getting into too much trouble. I'm going to take this guy with me. Because we got to sleep. 
And even if that means our death, we gotta sleep here. Because it's the only option right now. Did I lose him? I think I lost him. Oh, no, he's still there. So we'll just stand right here in this doorway, wait for this guy to come, deal with him. Come on, fall down. Come on, dude. I don't have time for this. Just need you to frickin' fall over. Come on, fall down. There we go. Right, nobody seems to have heard us or seen us, so we're gonna just go in here. And we are going to find the stairs, which I believe are don't know where the stairs are. Oh, there they are. It's dark. I can't see anything. And there's a zombie in here, apparently. It's so dark, I don't know where we are. <laughs> I hear somebody banging on a door now. Alright, I don't know what to do. Um, I'm gonna pick up this chair. And we are gonna go go back to the gas station and sleep in the storeroom. This is the best plan I got, guys. This is me running, by the way. Come on. All right. Wonder if we can do this. I'm really worried about getting eaten in the middle of the night. Or in the middle of our night, while we're asleep. Great. I don't know where you two came from, but I really wish you weren't here. Alright, I'm gonna count on them not following me. And we are going to go... oh, wrong side. We're going to go in the bathroom, we are going to place this chair, and we're going to sleep. Okay, sleep. Don't die. Please don't die. And you're thirsty. Okay. Hey, we didn't die. I guess we're not awake yet. Shouldn't, shouldn't count my chickens before they're hatched, right? And now we're awake. Okay. What happened to my... What happened to my water bottle? Oh, there it is. And we're super hungry. So let's drink one of these guys. There we go. Okay. I would like to finish what we started at the um, at the bar. Bar is probably not a success, a good place to stay long term, but there could be food there, so that's why I want to go check it out. I was thinking it could be a good place to stay long term, but clearly that is not the case. 
I'm not actually sure you can stay anywhere long term in this playthrough. So many freaking zombies everywhere. And as we have learned, even even moving out into the wilderness doesn't seem to help. Because <laughs> they just they migrate in. Gonna do a nice little wide circle here. Right, push through the trees and go into stealth mode. I hear a whole bunch. I hear like a large number of zombies. You two just don't see me. I, I just want to get in here without being bothered. That was the that was the door over there. That was the one I was trying to find. The door to the bathroom. Razor, toothbrush, sheets. Not gonna open those. Those are just those are just literally toilets. I think. Pickles, still good. That's it. All right. Trash can has nothing in it. Crate has nothing in it. This is where I was trying. I was trying to find the staircase. Oh, hello. Come on. Big bathroom. This is a flop house. This is where uh, there's a zombie in there, but. Nothing else, so I'm gonna leave you be. Oh, hello, you guys can stay in there too. I feel like there's a storage room somewhere in here. I don't remember where. Apparently I'm, also it appears to be that I'm just incorrect. Or is it right here? That is right here, okay. Crowbar. I guess I should take this? We're kind of over encumbered. But, I'm worried about us. Alright, so I'm gonna ditch this uh, shovel that is almost dead. This primary, we have f two pounds of free space. That's not a lot of space. Now, the crowbar is gonna put us over. Alright, can't take the crowbar. Try to remember it's there in case we ever get, get the space for it. Alright, so we're gonna head up this road here, which if memory serves, will take us to like a little trailer park area. A few playthroughs back, like a few builds back. I actually um, had that, that bar was my safe house area, so that's how I kind of remember what's around over here. Come on, everybody. Let's go this way. All right, so we'll do that. We'll go around this direction. Hopefully there's no horde waiting for us right here. There is not. That's a nice thing. And they can wander off wherever they feel like going. I wonder what time of day it is. I still think they need a time of day indicator. Oh, hello. Sorry. Didn't know you were in there. Very rude of me. Interrupt the lady when she's in the bathroom. You guys want to come out? Nope. There you go. Other one's coming out. That was interesting. Well, it was not what I was trying to do, but I'll take it. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Alright. I think there's at least one more zombie in here. 
Can opener and another lighter. Canned chili, don't mind if I do. Red wine. That is not going to help me so much, but I will take it anyways. Yeah, I knew there was one more. Just kind of want to see if there's anything. Nope. All right. Just want to see if there's anything actually useful in there, which there does not appear to be. So we'll just go this way. He follows me all the way out the window. I'll deal with him. Nope, doesn't know where I am. Come on out. Nope, let's step on him. There you go. What you got? Nothing. And a tea bag. All right. All right, um, I'm going to stop here for today, and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks so much.